So Willie Jackson is here with us now. Morena. Morena. Um, so all seven Māori seats the Māori Party is going after, what are their hopes? Well, they've, they've, they're a chance in three seats, not seven seats. They're a chance in three seats, and we talked about it last, last week. 50-50 in Auckland. They've got a mm. chance, a real chance with Rangi McLean. They've got an outstanding candidate with Chris McKenzie, but he's probably a 40% uh, a 40 chance, and I, and I would say Tudor or Flavor was without doubt the favourite in, in the Wairaki. So that's where their best chance lies. And that's where their hope really lies, isn't mm. it? Because without that seat, what does it mean? It means they're, they're gone, which would be a shame which would be very sad because, uh, you know, they've done well to get to 10 years. I've got to say, I get a bit sick of uh, uh, commentators, particularly Pākehā commentators, saying they've been a failure in that because they have had some success. There's no doubt about that. Whānau Ward is a great example of that. Auckland Statutory Board is a, another example. But what they've done is they've raised the consciousness of our people, you know, at a time when Labour forgot us in 2004. And for that, they should always be celebrated and remembered for because we needed, we had the hikoi back in 2004. It was fantastic. 20,000 people down there in Wellington. And, and, and it brought to uh, Parliament people like uh, Peter Sharples and Hune Harawera and Tariana Turia, who got through in Labour, but these others would probably never have got into Parliament, even to it off level. When you have strong pro-Māori views, you're not likely to get in in terms of some of the mainstream parties. So there's a lot to celebrate, but uh, some real strategic mistakes along the way, mm -hmm. you know, in terms of the Harawera departure, in terms of not patching Wait, things... Wait, mistake there was? Well, you know, they should the have managing tried... managing of it. Well, no, they should have tried to keep him in. But, but they had an opportunity in terms of bringing him back. They should have brought him back because now you have internet mana that is sort of capturing all, all the youth folk. Well, let's talk about um, our guys this morning, Patrick and Penny. What did mm. you make of them? Well, they're both young guns, you know. Pen, that Penny uh, Henare is uh, a young gun. He's uh, uh, um, But his, what he's got against him is not, not too known in Auckland at all. But he's, a, he's one of those young sort of Scotties or Julians, you know. <laughs> young guns in te reo Māori and in English. But he's been up in Moirewa. So he's got that against him down here in Auckland. But... Labour is strong. That's why he's very much 50-50 with Rangi McLean. Oh, you say 50-50? I've, I've always said the seat here is 50-50 uh, because Penny has, lucky enough, has Labour. Labour is still strong in mm. Auckland. And what about Patrick? Well, he's, he's a good young man. A good young man. He's got it all against him, unfortunately, for him. But you right, you had him on the ropes here. Uh, <laughs> I'm a, so curious terms... about that. How do people <coughs> fund uh, their candidacy? Well, 99% uh -huh. of them have to fund it on their own. He's very lucky because he's getting an MP salary from a dot com which is about 148 or 150,000 sort of uh, what you get on the side with your MCing and all that sort of yeah. stuff yeah, so, oh, well, so, so that's that, that's uh, that's how Patrick's going to get by but well, well done to the young fella putting his name up and uh, good to see a young Māori in there but it's fascinating to watch how internet mana are rolling at the moment they've got, a, ro they've got a road show happening at the moment yeah. Bunny and uh, uh, Lila Hari and Annette Sykes are out there so great to watch but this is uh, the next few weeks going to be fascinating Fascinating, Mitty, to see how the Māori Party uh, are they going to be able to fight That's their way exactly right. fight their way back into Parliament, and oh, it's, uh, we've got to watch that Waitaki seek. Yeah, we will indeed. Thanks for that.